More political news. Missouri lawmakers came up short today of making Missouri a right-to-work state. The governor's veto stands. KOMUH Colin Ruain was at day one of the veto session and joins us now in the studio with what both sides are saying. Well, Jim, that debate lasted for a large part of the afternoon during today's veto session. And not only were lawmakers from both sides of the aisle there, but workers who were largely opposed to the legislation watched and waited for several hours until the votes were cast. By your vote of 96 yes and 63 no, you have failed. Oh, yeah! They were told to hold their applause, but it didn't matter. Workers who voiced their opposition to right-to-work legislation celebrated after the House was not able to get a two-thirds majority to overturn Governor Nixon's veto. That bill generated most of the attention at Wednesday's veto session. Republican Representative Eric Burleson was the bill's sponsor and says he's disappointed in the decision. The more that we debate this issue and the more that people research it, the more that people start voting yes. He and several others in support of it say it would have helped the state's job market and kept employers from forcing workers to unionize. Opponents of right to work say it would have hurt the middle class. And at times like this, uh, it's not the time to be lowering wages. Um, or to be eroding uh, the rights of the middle class. Democratic Representative Stephen Weber voted against right to work and says the decision is a victory for workers across the state. Uh, we don't need to do anything that reduces wages, um, reduces salaries, or makes it harder for middle class Americans uh, who go to work every day uh, to make ends meet. The issue looks like it has come to an end for now. Still, Burleson tells us the right to work fight is far from over. It's not a matter of if Missouri becomes right to work, it's a matter of when Missouri becomes right to work. And Burleson told me he plans to bring the right to work debate back in the next legislative session by filing a bill. If the right to work debate comes back, it won't be for at least another few months. The 2016 legislative session starts in early January.